So we got here right before the sun came up. I think it really got light till about 7.30, but uh, so there's our material pile. Second load here on the forklift, and when we started there was no deck down. It is now 10 o'clock, so this is less than three hours worth of work. We are uh, almost up to the curve in the ramp. The uh, only thing slowing us down is that they have to cut these out in the deck. They cut these with the welding rods. And then we're doing these 5 8 uh, puddle welds. They weld to the beam. Once we get them all down, we'll have some more welding to do and uh, come back with lap screws where the uh, sheets of decking join. So there'll be four, four lap screws per span in between those welds. So I guess four, eight, 12, 12 screws per sheet per lap. Uh, the welds are made with 60, 22, 1 8 inch rods and that's a 5 8 inch auto weld. Everybody out here is hustling. We're planning to, uh, Giovanni was hoping to be done by, by 5 maybe. Um, I'm looking at these clouds, we've still got to fly back so hoping the weather stays good. But uh, we're just rocking along, making good progress. It's uh, a lot of fun. We got three welding machines right now. We've only got two going. But uh, we got a couple of uh, 250 amp welders. There's one of them over there. That can on the back is uh, propane. There's our spare propane tank. Um, and then over here, we got a big, big 400 amp machine. Giovanni and Elvis bringing the next sheet here. Is Alicio? Alicio! Giovanni, the, the welding machine, is it gas or diesel? Uh, the one the, that we have propane. propane. We got two propane, but one's a gas machine. Yeah, one is a gas machine. Does it take gas or diesel? Uh, diesel. Diesel yeah. fuel. Yeah, diesel fuel. Okay. We got one diesel, and uh, we're getting close. Hey, we're close to the building after. Getting close to the building, yep. Yeah. Hopefully in a few hours, I'll have a uh, short clip of the finished product.